Hi students, this video is presenting by dgindiaedu.com. Today we are presenting on C. V. Raman, the first Indian to win the Nobel Prize for Physics. Sir Chandrasekhar Venkat Raman was an Indian physicist born in the former Madras province in India, presently the state of Tamil Nadu who carried out groundbreaking work in the field of light scattering which earned him the 1930 Nobel Prize for Physics. He discovered that when light traverses a transparent material some of the deflected light changes wavelength. This phenomenon subsequently known as Raman scattering results from the Raman effect. In 1954 India honored him with its highest civilian award the Bharat Ratna. Raman employed monochromatic light from a mercury arc lamp which penetrated transparent material and was allowed to fall on a spectrograph to record its spectrum. He detected lines in the spectrum which were later known Raman lines. He presented his theory at a meeting of scientists in Bangalore on 16th March 1928 and won the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1930. In Munich, some physicists were initially unable to reproduce Raman's results, leading to spectrism. However, Peter Pringsheim was the first German to reproduce Raman's results successfully. He sent spectra to Arnold Summerfield. Pringsheim was the first to coin the term Raman effect and Raman lines. Raman was honored with a large number of honorary doctorates and memberships of scientific societies. He was elected a fellow of the Royal Society early in his career 1924 and knighted in 1929. He resigned from the fellowship of the Royal Society in 1968 for unrecorded reasons, the only Indian FRS ever to do so. In 1930, he won the Nobel Prize in Physics. In 1941, he was awarded the Franklin Medal. In 1954, he was awarded the Bharat Ratna. He was awarded the Lenin Peace Prize in 1957. In 1998, the American Chemical Society and Indian Association for the Cultivation of Science recognized Raman's discovery as the International Historic Chemical Landmark. India celebrates National Science Day on 20th February of every year to commemorate the discovery of the Raman effect in 1928. Raman was married on 6th May 1907 to Lokasundari Ammal. They had two sons, Chandrasekhar and radio astronomer Radhakrishnan. Raman was the paternal uncle of Subramanian Chandrasekhar who later won the Nobel Prize in Physics 1983 for his discovery of the Chandrasekhar limit in 1931 and for his subsequent work on the nuclear reaction necessary for stellar evolution. At the end of October 1970, Raman collapsed in his laboratory. The valves of his heart had given away. He was moved to the hospital and the doctors gave him four days to leave. He survived and after a few days refused to stay in the hospital as he preferred to die in the gardens of his institute surrounded by his followers. Two days before Raman died, he told one of his former students, do not allow the journals of the academy to die, for they are the sensitive indicators of the quality of science being done in the country and whether science is taking root in it or not. The same evening, Raman met with the board of management of his institute and discussed with them any proceeding with regards to the institute's management. Raman died from natural causes early next morning 
on 21st November 1970. Hope you enjoyed this video. Keep in touch with us. Do not forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you for watching us again.